Hello YouTube, and here's another video. I'm going to be showing you how to overclock your Mac, Mac Pro, Mac Mini, whatever kind of Mac, or whatever kind of computer you have, whether it be PC, whatever. Now, you're going to need a program called MSI Afterburner. Let's run over there real quick. MSI Afterburner. It's going to be right here. I have it under my history, so just look for that. I go to their site. And you can either download this version, which is like their, you know, latest version thing, um, their manual, or the latest beta. I just get the beta, I don't know, just to be sure, whatever it could be, have something of use, I guess I should say. So after you download that, I already have it, I already got the program. You're going to launch it, install it, you know. Okay, so what I do <coughs> is bring it up to a safe level, which is... You can max it out on these. These are the MacBook Pro is underclocked like severely. So yeah, and then I have a profile which you can create, but for some reason it's uh, glitching right now. So you can do this. You can do whatever your levels are. I usually do about right there. Save. Press whatever slot you want to save it to. That one. I just lock it to do whatever. Okay, and then it's overclocked. It is that easy. It is very easy. I'll make a video of. Um, me playing a game while it's overclocked and when it's not overclocked. So I'll make another video of that and I'll link it to it, this one. Simple, very simple to do. You can look up online if you want to look up like safe levels of overclocking. It's not really that big of a deal. Just p keep in mind that it isn't, s okay, it's safe, but it also is not safe. So just make sure you're always careful of what you do. I believe that Somewhere in this program has a screen recording program too. I don't know, they have a bunch of stuff that comes with this. You can detach it, you can have all this stuff wherever you want, it doesn't matter. Close out of it when you're done if you want to keep it back. So, you can go to settings, whatever GPU you want. I don't know if you have multi-GPU or you're running them together or whatever. So you can either start it, un... okay, they're talking about voltage controls. Depends on your graphics card. Mine is everything. Everything is pretty much set. I can't control the core voltage or fan speed since this is a custom made motherboard and it's built in and infused with it so I can't do anything about that. So that is how you overclock a... Well, this is a 2010 MacBook Pro. I don't know the clock speeds are going to be for the new one because uh, I think they're about 800 megahertz they're running at. Yeah that should be what it is. Okay that's all guys. Uh, any questions, leave in a comment or message me or whatever. Bye.